Hello, Internet people. Welcome back. It's a Necromancer. It's a Necromancer who appears to have some kind of shield and is protecting themselves from my fireballs. This is a problem. So, we're just gonna have to do this then. You think you stand a chance? Yes, I'm punching you right in the face. Oh, there she goes. Well, that would explain. Oh yes, I want Necromancer's robes so my magic regenerates 75% faster. That bone is rolling around, floating a little bit in the air. Necromancers and their enchantments, A. Eh? What were you guys doing up here? Something grody. You really shouldn't do things like that. Well, that wasn't nearly as exciting as I thought it was going to be, Internet people. I thought that was going to be some big, long dungeon with all sorts of stuff, but it just, it wasn't. I still have to get onto that mountain, though. Oh, is that the sea? I think it is. Isn't that lovely? Oh my god, a rabbit! Anyway. How the hell am I gonna get on this mountain? Ah. Uh. God damn it. He doesn't seem interested in landing at all, so I'm just gonna go up to the Shrine of Azura, and then if he lands near me, I will shoot some fireballs at him, but other than that, I can't hit him. He's too far away. Uh oh, oh dear. I seem to be ascending. And when I ascend, I come much closer to the giant evil dragon. Oh, I think he's finally noticed me. Oh my god, I will never hit you. Oh my god. I think that's it. Well, that has to be it. My goodness. That is gigantic. Absolutely gigantic. Yeah, still a bit of a sociopath, I gotta say. Even in the presence of her Lady Azura. Azura has seen your coming, Traveler. It was not curiosity, but fate that has led you here. What do you mean? Azura has given me the gift of foresight. I had a vision of you walking up the steps to this altar long before you were born. You have been chosen to be her champion. I know it is unexpected, but do not worry. It will all unfold as she has predicted. Well, what does Azura need? You must go to a fortress endangered by water yet untouched by it. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know, but Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they know this elven enchanter. Who built the shrine? My people, the Dunmer, built it. We fled from Morrowind after Vardenfell erupted almost 200 years ago. Those of us who were faithful to Azura were given a vision that led us away from the island before the worst came. This shrine is our thanks to her, that none will forget that she watches over us all. 
And are you, are, you, are you all alone here now? Yes. There were others at first. But Azura's visions tested everyone's faith. One by one, they left. Afraid to know their own future. But I refuse to abandon the shrine. The visions are a gift. Azura warns me of tragedy, war, death. Before it happens, I won't leave her guidance. This has all been foreseen, and we must play our parts. Well then, I guess I was going to go to Winterhold anyway. Where did that dragon go? Does he sleep? Do they do that? <gasps> I guess they have to sleep. Yeah, well. What can you do when the dragon that you wanted to slay disappears? She's gonna just jump off the cliff, isn't it? Oh, no, I think she's smart enough to go around. Lydia, that is. Everyone's favorite. This place looks really, really inviting right now. In the middle of the night. If those white run guards can take down a dragon, so can we. I bet you could. The frozen hearth. Sorry, could you describe the smell? Unless you're bringing me another round, you turned it inside out and then exploded. What did you do? It was a minor miscalculation. I've already corrected it for future experiments. This. This is why people have a problem with your college now. Just say the word if you need a drink or something to eat. I, need a I don't bed. deal with any college applicants these days, so don't bother asking. Okay. If there's anything you need, just let me know. Um. Hmm. I'd like to rent a room, please. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. This is an oath to Skyrim's truest sons and daughters. I'll show you to your room. The storm like this cloaks. We'll ask about we other things. Who are you? And today's come and gone. Sleep well. Where am I? Who are you? Does it matter? You're warm, dry, and still very much alive. That's more than can be said for old Grelod, hmm? You know about that? Half of Skyrim knows. Old hag gets butchered in her own orphanage. Things like that tend to get around. Oh, but don't misunderstand. I'm not criticizing. It was a good kill. Old Crone had it coming. And you saved a group of urchins to boot. But there is a slight mm, problem. A problem? You see, that little Eratino boy was looking for the Dark Brotherhood. For me and my associates. Grelod the Kind was, by all rights, a Dark Brotherhood contract. A kill that you stole. A kill you must repay. So you want me to murder someone else? Well now, funny you should ask. If you turn around, you'll notice my guests. I've collected them from... Well, that's not really important. The here and now. That's what matters. You see, there's a contract out on one of them, and that person can't leave this room alive. But, oh, which one? Go on. See if you can figure it out. Make your choice. Make your kill. I just want to observe and admire. Am I to take your silence as acceptance? Then you know where we stand. Make your kill and we're square. Repayment of your debt is but a discreet knife thrust away. I... 
I can hear you talking out there. Please let me go. I've done nothing to you. Who are you? My name is Full Time. I'm a soldier. Well, mercenary, really. You know, a, a, a sellsword. I've lived in Skyrim all my life. That's all. I'm a nobody, really. So, can't you just let me go? Mm. Would someone pay to have you killed? What? Oh, God. I, I don't want to die. You can tell me. Okay, well, I guess it's possible. I've been selling my sword arm for years now. It kills a lot of people. Could be someone wanted revenge. But, uh, but you're not going to kill me, right? Uh, uh, what did I do? Uh, please, Get whatever these it is. Things uh, off of me. And who are you? None of your damn business who I am. If you're going to kill me, just do it already. Edmara is my witness. If I didn't have this hood on right now, I would spit right in your face. Would someone pay to have you killed? Excuse me. What kind of question is that? One last time. Would someone pay to have you killed? I'm kneeling here with my hands bound and a sack over my head. And you have the gall to ask me that? What do you think, genius? I don't have time for this nonsense. I've got a whole Whoever this is, is clearly we got off on the wrong foot. Ah, but no worries. This is not the first time I have been bagged and dragged. Really? Who are you? Ah, Varsha, at your service. Obtainer of goods, taker of lives, and defiler of daughters. Have you not heard of me? Perhaps I will have my people carve my name in your corpse as a reminder. I'm going to assume that someone would pay to have you killed. Me? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Come on, Vasha. You can tell me. <laughs> the real question is, would someone pay to have me killed again? A day goes by without someone trying to cut me in the street. I get disappointed. Mm. Tell you what, you release me and I promise my associates will not cut you down like an animal and butcher you in the street. It is a win-win. Stop talking. The conniving Khajiit. A cat like that was sure to have enemies. It's no wonder you chose him. So who was it? Oh, no, no, no. Don't you understand? Guilt, innocence, right, wrong? Irrelevant. What matters is I ordered you to kill someone, and you obeyed. So can I go now, then? Of course. And you've repaid your debt in full. Here's the key to the shack. But why stop here? I say we take our relationship to the next level. I would like to officially extend to you an invitation to join my family. The Dark Brotherhood. In the southwest reaches of Skyrim, in the Pine Forest, you'll find the entrance to our sanctuary. It's just beneath the road, hidden from view. When questioned by the Black Door, Answer with the correct passphrase, Silence, my brother. Then you're in, and your new life begins. I'll see you at home. I think we're gonna have to make that an episode, Internet People. Next time I'm going to try and figure out where the hell I am. Thanks for watching.